this is our, our kind of first major milestone, was demonstrating this remote control capability. And that is really building the foundation for moving forward. Joystick working, we can push start in the bubble, drag forward, so forward just acts like a throttle. And their kind of long-term goal was to have this boat operating fully autonomously. It's fun to look back and realize how much of an impact this, this research and technology can actually have. It's just, um, it makes me feel like I'm actually making an impact that could, you know, help countries throughout the world, help the United States, or, you know, it, it, could, it could be used in a variety of ways. Ultimately, we can see this vessel being operated in small groups with a command module that goes with it that can be rapidly be deployed into the field for either research or military operations or special force operations, marine interdiction agencies, Coast Guard applications, uh, port security. There's, there's many applications for this uh, small craft here. This kind of uh, partnership between a, a, a world-class university with engineering capabilities, students and creativity combined with a, uh, a partner in the commercial space is what the future of Louisiana is all about. We're building off of something that we have a strength and now, and that is our maritime capability. And so this kind of partnership is great for the university, uh, it, it, it's great for the students, and it's also great for the company. The universities are always replenishing themselves with new ideas, new students, and as an innovative company, we're always looking to capture that next thing. Being able to showcase what, what we're capable of, uh, working with industrial partners, meeting their needs, and hopefully exceeding their needs, um, and then kind of proving them, hey, this is this worthwhile to work with those guys at UL. They know what they're doing. They're going to provide some real value for the money that that you provide to the research program.